as you listen to the sounds and the words around you. And sometimes <coughs> I will be speaking. Sometimes I'll be speaking. And sometimes, sometimes we'll be speaking, speaking together. And you can make whatever adjustments you need to be even more relaxed. I'm not going to go that way because they And you'll know relaxed. when I'm speaking to you now. Because you're really talking right at you. Right to now I know, Teresa, you have a wealth of experience in switching off sensations. There are times when you go to the movies, the cinema, and you sit in your seat, and you are so enthralled with what's going on on the screen in front of you, you forget about everything. And it's almost like you're not aware of your body at all. And yet, if what was on the screen wasn't so interesting for you, maybe you'd be sitting there fidgeting and realizing just how uncomfortable that scene was. So I know your unconscious has experience of turning off sensations and letting go. Now for the benefit of this experiment, what I'd like you to do is to go even deeper inside. And I'd like you to imagine in your mind's eye you had a container of silvery liquid. Now this silvery liquid in your mind is your body's natural anesthesia. And in a moment, really yet, as I begin counting down, you can allow that natural silver liquid to begin to flow. And as it moves down through your body, you begin to forget, to lose sensation. And when I get all the way down to zero, it will be as if there is no body at all, just your mind and thoughts. And as this silvery liquid flows down your body, taking away those sensations, giving you calm, comfortable relaxation, flowing down now, your unconscious can begin to realize how and when this will be useful to you in the future. Now just begin to allow that silvery liquid to flow down through your body as it goes down now. Those sensations begin to dissolve. 30, all the way down. Continue counting down in your mind with each breath, each number, that silvery fluid, that anesthesia begins to flow all the way down, that's right, all the way down your body. And in a moment, but not yet, in a moment, you can touch on the back of your right hand. As that liquid flows down through your body, you're going to send the liquid now down to your right hand so that your right hand becomes almost wooden. So that when I touch it in a moment, you're not going to be aware of any sensation. You're not going to be aware of any sensations at all. For well, that silvery liquid is clearing away all sensation, allowing your body to relax deeper and deeper, more and more inside, more comfortable. Now when your right hand is completely lost, all of its sensation, you can indicate to me your left hand, and I'm just about to put your left hand up on 
to your left. There you are. So when your right hand has lost all sensation completely, indicate to me with the index finger of your left hand. Just allow that silvery liquid to continue flowing down your body, down the arm. And when it's lost all sensation in your right hand, you can indicate yes to your left index finger. Now, in a moment, Teresa, I'm going to count from one to three. When I get to the number three, you can open your eyes and you can speak to us and you can raise your head. The rest of your body remains deeply in trance. And your right hand remains completely numb. Completely numb. And when you're ready, when you're ready to do that, Teresa, Indicate to me with the finger, the index finger of your left hand. I will count to three. You will raise your head and be able to speak to us. And the rest of your body remains completely numb. Your right hand completely devoid of any sensation. And when you're ready, just indicate now with the finger of your left hand. Thank you, Teresa. One. Two, three. You can raise your head, you can talk to me, but the rest of your body remains completely numb. Thank you, Phil. How does this feel? When you picture me. <laughs> How does that feel? Well, that's a good sort of story. Thank you. Switch. Just remain inside, completely relaxed, completely calm. Now, Teresa, where else could this, you utilize this? Where else would this be useful to you in the future? Allow your unconscious right now to take all that learning. And at any point in the future, if you want to be able to switch off sensations, it will be just as easy as remembering this trance and going inside. What calls the sensations and the suggestions? Don't just stop with Teresa. They can spill out to anyone in the room. And your unconscious can learn how to apply these phenomena just when you need to, just when it will be most right and appropriate for you. Because there's so many opportunities for you to use these trance phenomena. I think of at least one, two, maybe three, four, five, seven. 